Well, a new airline taking off in Northeast Ohio called Breeze Airways. And according to the Wall Street Journal, it's just one of the more than 90 new airlines set to launch this year. This new addition is coming to Akron Canton Airport, where it plans to offer fares, get this, as low as $39. Our January Keaton has details on Breeze Airways flying in and out of our area. Our new air service entrant is Breeze Airways. Akron Canton Airport CEO Ren Camacho announcing the addition of another low cost airline to the airport. Starting next month, Breeze Airways will add new nonstop flights from Akron Canton Airport to three destinations. To Charleston four times a week. There's going to be two times a week to New Orleans um, during November and December that goes to three times. And then Tampa is going to start off at one time a week on Saturdays. When they fly Breeze, it's going to be simple. They're going to book easy. They're going to get to the airport. Everything's going to be easy. Breeze founder David Nealman also founded JetBlue and several other low-cost airlines. He created Breeze to offer, quote, seriously nice nonstop flights from smaller secondary airports while offering fares as low as 39 bucks along underserved routes with high flexibility and no hassle. We've got values that we live by every day. And, you know, I, I really love being the nicest airline. They're kind. They're sincerely nice people. Adding Breeze to Akron Canton's airline roster has been in the works for quite some time. In talks since June of 2019, airport officials say Breeze was a good match then and a good match even through the pandemic. And now that Ohio's opening back up, the sky's the limit. This announcement marks a once in a lifetime chance to further connect Northeast Ohio residents to other individuals, to new places, and to exciting opportunities. <laughs> now, in case you're wondering whether these cheap flights are any less dangerous or more dangerous, I should say, than the regular flights, the answer is no. I checked the FAA, FAA's website and they said that these budget flights are no more dangerous than any other commercial airline flights. Now, that $39 that was mentioned in the piece, that is just one way, just so you know. It's not $39 round trip, of course, $39 one way. Also, the Breeze flight, they haven't started yet, so you can't book just yet. They don't start until June 26th. Okay, $39, though, even one way. I mean, round trip. Come on, how great would that be? But right. I'll, take, I'll take the 39 bucks one way. January, thanks so much. Great information there. <laughs>